Hello friends, welcome to my kitchen. I am Rashmi Sharma Pawe and today I am going to show you a very healthy recipe that is fish cooked with fresh turmeric. Mas aru kesa halodir anja. This is a recipe filled with goodness. Turmeric as you know is a great anti-inflammatory and a pain reliever. It is even better if your turmeric is fresh. Here I have taken 200 grams of fresh turmeric, peeled it and sliced it. Then two red chilies, you may take green chili also but red chilies will give you a nice color which I have de-seeded. Half teaspoon salt and one inch piece of ginger. I shall grind this to a fine paste. Add a little water. This is done and now I shall take this out in this steel bowl. It is always better to take a steel bowl for taking out your turmeric because it leaves a very dark yellow stain otherwise if you use a plastic or a melamine. To this I shall add half teaspoon cumin powder and one teaspoon coriander powder. If possible always use homemade masalas. Just wash your cumin and coriander whole, then dry it, just roast it a little bit on a tawa and then when cool grind it to a fine powder. I mix this and now I shall show you the other ingredients of today's recipe. Apart from this paste, we will require mustard oil about 100 ml, fish which I already fried. I fried it lightly. You may fry it a little deeper if you want. One medium potato, a few nigella seeds, salt, salt to taste. I already added half teaspoon to the turmeric paste, then crushed pepper and coriander leaves which is optional. It is always better to cook turmeric curry in a non-stick pan or karai because it is very sticky fresh turmeric is very sticky and it tends otherwise to stick to your karai or pan so here I have taken a non-stick pan my oil is heated and now I'll crackle the nigella seeds it crackled completely and now it's time to add the turmeric paste. I shall fry this for about 10 to 15 minutes on a very low flame stirring once in a while so that the oil gets completely released. Turmeric is bitter in taste and to remove the bitterness it's very important to fry the paste well. Now I'll add the potatoes and fry further for about another 10 minutes. Now I shall slowly add water. I shall fry this for another 2 to 3 minutes on a low plate and covered. Now the remaining salt and water. Yes, this water is warm and I always prefer adding warm water to my curries. It's boiling and now I'll add the fish. Now I shall cook this for about 4 to 5 minutes. Now pepper and fresh coriander. My curry is done. Now I shall transfer this to a serving bowl and serve with steaming hot rice. Well friends, if you enjoyed watching this video, do hit the like button, share it, make it and subscribe to my channel Rashmi Simple Food Delights for your regular updates. Till we meet next, goodbye.